Welcome everybody, I'm Raytech, and Ben's on the other end. Hello! And uh, I've just chosen to restart my map. I'm going for a small map this time around. And uh, I'm going to follow Ben's example of putting down a hole straight away. I'll just uh, bring up uh, my roads. I've actually gone to the liberty of starting a new map. I've, I'm happy with this map as it is. Put all the roads down, the hole is down, and now I get to start pretty much again. And I'm going to be starting taking some advice from some of my viewers and actually, you know, doing a moat, moat type design. Basically, yeah. dig out a moat to start off with. Yeah, that's that's a good idea. Um, and, and they look good. Although it they look better when you have water, obviously. True. I don't have water, unfortunately, on this map. But uh, we work with what we've got. Mm-hmm. That is often the that's always the case that's <laughs> almost so never how are things going want. on your end well um i'm trying to remember exactly where i left off and honestly i uh don't remember the last thing that happened i believe it was not too long after i had a new migrant whom i cannot recall what their they, who they were at this point <laughs> um, was it Jennifer here, maybe? Could be. Yeah, it's definitely a, a, a benefit of getting that hole down pretty much as soon as you can. Well, nowadays, anyway. Yeah. Apparently, back in the um, back in the old days of other patches, uh, having a hole this early was uh, pretty much a death sentence. <laughs> um, not quite so nowadays. Not quite, yeah, as long as you're, you're careful. Um, don't melee a skeleton um that's yeah yeah I that's instant that one. death <laughs> um jennifer the archer you are gonna be a blacksmith although i should really uh i really really you know what i should really pick uh rickman here he should be my blacksmith because it takes so long for a blacksmith to level up. And then Jennifer, you go and be a wood chopper. Why not? Oh, I like the female uh, lumberjack outfit. <laughs> Looking good. You got like a little hat and <laughs> it's like pigtails pulled back. That's that's kind of <laughs> cute. Uh, independently chop trees. Go for it. I just. Although maybe you should. Yeah, I've got to go through all my guys and find huh. out who's who's good at what. Huh? Because I have plenty of wood, and I probably should worry about keeping my wealth to a moderate level. Hmm. Yeah, that's the. Or that's going to be pretty much the. Uh, the worry is to keep your wealth down for as long as you possibly can. Right. Chicken, you look like a goblin. <laughs> uh, yeah, all right. It's looking pretty good still. All right, so yeah, I'm not going to have her chop wood right now. So, um... Okay, Rickman, Abel Cole. Blacksmith. Yeah, let's see. Where do we put the blacksmith? Blacksmith's going over here. Good, chop some trees. Okay, and my traders just gone to off and wanted to straight to the hole, so that's fine. Uh, I think I'm going to need a hunting knife and a few tools, pretty much off the bat. Because uh, this uh, particular um, start that I've got, tools-wise, they just gave me pretty much one stool tool, uh, one stone tool of everything, and that's huh. it. Well. So if I break one, very soon it's game over. <laughs> <laughs> Just make sure you have wood and stone. Yeah. As long as you so do much... that, you'll be okay. Okay, so stone forge, stone anvil. Shoot, which end of the anvil do they use? Does it matter? No, I don't think it matters much, actually. Uh, those, those three and one hunting knife. Add that to there. there. Now I've got to allocate right. someone. 
And Actually, stone mason can build those tools. So. Taylor. Hmm. Now, luckily with this uh, map that I've got, the uh, I've actually got uh, seeds from all the farms. Actually, speaking of seeds, yeah, one of my uh, subscribers came up with a, a solution for uh, or your seed storage seed storage problem. Oh, and that is to go plant a crop of seeds, then undesignate the uh, plot. It'll destroy the seeds. So pretty much, you go huh. go out and plant a whole crop. Undesignated, all those seeds that you've just planted, they're gone. Okay, yeah. Yep, that's true. That's true. Um, that does take a bit of farmer time, but yeah, that's certainly a possibility. It's one way to get uh, reclaim your food storage. Yeah, I sure. mean, I mean, eventually it's going to be what you'll have to do, and I guess, you know, when you get to the point of having like, you know, 800 food or whatever, it's probably, probably okay. Codest is now a level I'm... 14 stonemason. Nice. <laughs> no problem leveling up the stonemason. Yeah, stonemasons are generally pretty quick to level up, aren't they? Yeah. That's... I think I'm going to go for little tiny farm plots to start off with. <laughs> What's now? I think I've got one of everything. I don't know. <laughs> the only problem with the farm plots, they the the only time you're gonna know what's in them is when they're actually growing. Yeah. Dig mine. All right, we're we're tunneling down, getting getting below ground here. Right, so that's I've got a wood chopper, I've got a miner, I've got someone actually going to make some tools. There you go, guys. I just want to think so. Take all that out. I gotta wait for, yeah, I gotta wait for some wood to come in. Wow. Oh. I suppose I could actually set someone to. All right, everybody, uh, let's double time it. Ah, uh, miner. Yep, skill-wise, I've actually not uh, got a lot of um, really skilled people, so I'm going mm, to have yeah. to try and uh, yeah make do with what I've got. Uh, making sure my forager is on a very short leash, and you give him a, a, like a massive two on his inventory, so he'll keep coming back to me. Right, trader, what are you good at other than trading? Not much else. He can build. <laughs> well, at least uh, at least you've got a trader. Yeah, true, true. Uh, oh, I got another merchant. Wow. That's... What do you think the odds are that he'll actually trade me anything? <laughs> Probably none. <laughs> That would suck, but I this has you know obviously been reloaded since the last time, so mm. maybe I don't remember who my trader is. Oh, and he's here, so I need to find them. I think I'll keep my um, trader wood chopper on a short leash as well, because I really, really, really need that wood right now. Frost, that's right, Frost, get your butt over here. And trade. And there we go. They're trading. Field stone. Put some more of that. Oh, great, great. Uh, giving you eight raw stone in exchange for eight wood logs. Not terribly exciting. Uh, Better than nothing. Yeah. Uh, no thanks. I, I'll I'll decline that one. But, um. But you still you, you, wouldn't you get any skills for that trade? I think you the your uh, trader gains skill just for. Oh here we go here we go four steel ingots in exchange for twelve wood logs. That's more like it. 
I think your trader gets skill, I was saying, <laughs> regardless of whether or mm -hmm. not there are any trades or you accept or decline. I think it's just a number, the number of times they meet with merchants. I see. Because I'm the last time when the trader didn't even offer me anything, um, Frost here still leveled up. Ah. All right, well, let's go back into double time. Trade faster. And that was it. All right, that's cool. Steal. That's awesome. I mean, I'll hang on to it for now. I've got no illusions about my blacksmith being able, competent enough to uh, <laughs> to work with it. But, mm. um, I can't remember what you were, Frost. Oh, you were a carpenter. That's right. Eventually, I'll remember. Uh, oh no. Oh no. Um, have you been digging all dirt root. again? <laughs> yeah, I think I am. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. Yeah, oh heck. Um, mm, er. <laughs> That's a little this bit This could fun. be a problem. Because, <laughs> honestly, all that's right. not that's not the first time it's happened to you. No, it hasn't. I can, I've, I'm pretty sure I can work around this. At least I hope so. <laughs> <laughs> uh, right. Now, we'll dig out that amount of stone. Stone mason. What do you... Uh, hopefully, we'll get you go over here. And we'll take Humphrey Lacombe. What a name. <laughs> Humphrey. That's, that's a pretty serious name, yeah. And I'll increase his encumbrance. Dig. And I'll tell him to come dig, over dig, and dig. dig some stone also. And hopefully... Yep, there we go. Fixed. Okay, and they have some place to put it. Well, once they uh, have enough stone on them, I dare say. Uh, I'm actually... not sure if that's how it works. I'm <laughs> uh, pretty sure it is. What do you come over this way? You can find out. We are going to find out. At... Humphrey is moving very, very slowly. Oh, I need some more flagstone. Fieldstone, not flagstone. Fieldstone. So I uh, start placing dirt. Ah! Dig, oh dig, dear, dig. oh dear. Dig it up. Right, um, hmm. Yeah, I've got to get someone to actually start building dirt. Go away with that. Celeste. You know, hey, we got a Celeste deal. here. Change you to a builder. Oh no. Can he not path up here again? Oh, you guys. This is ridiculous. This pathing is horrible. No, I don't want to remove a bush. What the hell? I'm underground. Okay, well, the walls are going to be started, started out with dirt. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's better than no wall at all. Another Sorry. merchant! Frost, you're already there. Be your trader. Might hit level 7 this time. Oh, jeez, I'm out of food. When did that happen? Know. Um, how's everybody doing on hunger? Mm, that's scary. Let's let's slow it down for a sec, so I can check out, make sure nobody's about to starve. I think I've gone through it and gone. I've hit that well generation. Okay, no, thing. no one's starving. That's good. Uh, I definitely got to get some guys with the like digging up some stone. Okay, I, what I gotta do. <laughs> 
I have got to make more farms. I don't know why I haven't yet. Kind of just being lazy, I guess. Okay, yeah. Oh dear. Dirt. Why did the, the mining piles have to be stone? <laughs> I mean, really. Well, it's blue. I think that should mean that it's <laughs> it's gonna they're gonna build it. Oh it, yeah, it does too. Yeah, Yay! it'd be it'd be yellow if if it was uh not and they didn't have the resources. So yeah, cool. All right, mining stockpile being done. Yeah, I just gotta remove some of some troublesome trees. There they go. All right, great. They're trading. Snowfallen's a level seven farmer, so yes, clearly he's he's got too much time on his hands. Is the problem? There, and he gave us a bunch of food. Good, good. Everybody eat. Everyone eat while the eating's good. Everybody's leveling up. Okay, my forage is going, going around killing just about everything in sight, which is great. <laughs> um, let's see, what can I make my... Nothing. Another, another nothing trade merchant. That's ridiculous. You suck. Never come back. <laughs> Be gone with him! Alright. Give me that stump. Hmm. Maybe I'll take my herder and make her a farmer for a little while. Although well, good at pretty much everything else. <laughs> Uh, I do believe I don't have another stone hoe. Um, but we'll I... work on that. What's going on with the cross stone? I should probably track that just in case. Although, I'm not going to really be short on it now. Mm hmm. Okay, remove that tree stump as well. So yeah, pretty much we'll we'll start off with uh, a bit of a dirt wall, a bit of a moat. Yeah. And um, yeah, we're just gonna have to basically try and keep a track of uh, any enemies that uh, may or may not uh, appear. <laughs> well, late morning on day one, I really shouldn't be getting anybody. I really hope not. By the looks of it, it's pretty safe. So, yeah, just keep a good scan about. I mean, really, day one should be completely no monsters of any kind. Mm. That's in my opinion. I don't know if that's the case, but... Um, even yeah, even day two is pushing care. it. You reckon? Yeah, I mean, day two, like... I was able to have just the absolute, barely a two block high stone wall at the end of day two. And that's only by exploding, exploding, you know, the height differences building on top of a hill to even get to that. Mm. Um, I mean, I guess really you could just be, you know, super proactive and be sending out your, uh, your military people the moment that there's a enemy yeah. spotted, but that's pretty risky early on. You know, it's entirely dependent upon you lucking into the right initial loadout for your military. Yeah, oh. Okay, run out of uh, space for wood logs. So, okay, we can we can manage this. Oh boy. Yeah, starting out is uh, actually qu quite uh, interesting uh, once again. <laughs> uh, storage, you gotta yeah. get all the things together. Although the initial compound is going to be fairly small, so this could be interesting. 
so hopefully we'll be able to basically just uh, get a, a defensible position together. Um, mm. I've been told ballistas are quite nice to have in the early game as well. So. Oh yeah. Yeah, I guess. What do you build the bolts out of? I didn't think of that. What are those bolts? Uh, right? Iron and wood. That's all, huh? Yep. Supposed to bolt one log, one iron ingot. Huh. Yeah, that's not bad. Um. <laughs> what do we have? Enoch is a little frustrated. He's decided that he hates this hay bale. <laughs> ah, die, ah. Okay, okay, Enoch, chill. <laughs> he, oh, I see, he broke a pickaxe, and he just got so angry. <laughs> he just had to start wailing on the on the hay bale. Oh, oh, geez, now Lynette's doing the same. Did I designate that to be Doug? Um, oh, maybe I somehow... Weird. Look at that. It's like... Got that part of the hay bale designated to be dug up. Interesting bug. I think I'll put some chairs down just around the place. Just for... Um, to keep people out, when, oh. out of uh, trouble. There we go. That's I was hitting the wrong button. Okay, there we go. <laughs> yeah, that really bugged them out. That that's crazy. Uh, uh, Oster, Oster Thatcher. We'll ch change you into a carpenter. See how badly you can try and make chairs. Uh, um. Do you think if uh, like people have chairs, they actually um, don't require food that much, or? Um, I don't, I don't know if the chairs have anything beyond aesthetic purposes. Apart from removing uh, troublesome people. Four and four. There, plant some carrots. We need more foods. Oh, and it's getting wrong. dark. Oh, I really do need an upgrade. I've been uh, wanting a new upgrade for my PC for quite some time, but yeah? uh, I'm going to have to wait until my taxes come in. Oh, so sure. I know I'll be, I'll be getting a, a sizable refund for that. Gotcha, nice. So come about, uh, we, we do our taxes in the middle of the year. I don't know uh, what's, what it is in oh. the U.S., but... Um, uh, U.S. taxes aren't due until April. Uh, that's really strange. Well, the, it's just kind of like they're for the previous year. So you don't oh, get okay. all of your bank documentation and stuff until... Uh, it's kind of like legally required that the bank send you everything by the end of January. And then they just right. give everybody until April 15th to uh, file oh, okay. and everything. We're usually done by the end of February, though. And we usually, usually have our refund by the end of February. <laughs> yeah, we, we have to uh, get all our um, tax uh, documentation by uh, a very early July. And we get our uh, do do our taxes then. So hmm. once that all that's uh, sorted out, I get my refund, and it will be an upgrade for that I've been hanging out for a long while. So awesome. It'll be all good. Yeah. So so people, this is what it's like to be YouTubing on a uh, quad core, <laughs> very old system. It is sometimes a little bit hard, but uh, it's doable nonetheless. Can be done. Oh, sure, man. I started my channel on a dual-core laptop. Wow. <laughs> so if you go and watch any of the pretty old videos, I mean, you can tell because I did a vlog when I built my new PC. And so you can tell before and after, you know, when it was. And uh, definitely some, some games got quite a, a good frame rate boost. But yeah, it's it's uh, 
kind of nowadays, especially if you're st sticking with indie games, there's not necessarily, you know, top of the line graphics requirements. So, exactly. If if you wanted to actually deal with all of the content ID garbage, you know, you just really wanted to be part of that, you could. <laughs> <laughs> I actually haven't been impacted at all, but uh, I've, I would I would say I've only been impacted maybe once, and that was for Kerbal Space. Oh yeah, yeah. There was there was something weird going on with the music for that. I think mm. I had my music turned down far enough that it never even got flagged. All right, I think everybody is asleep. Let me just check. Struggling to sleep struggling to sleep make sure everybody is struggling to sleep on the ground <laughs> yeah, yeah I think I, I, think I looped I'll be doing that as well. <laughs> yeah I, I must have looped through there I could I lost track of who I started on um, but yeah there we go great uh, hopefully we'll have some good food crops in the morning uh, so I'll cut this one here and uh, catch everybody in the next timber and stone day moving into day five <laughs>